Hi everyone, so today I will be reacting to the second episode of the What If series. Oh my god, and the premise of the series is so exciting. Guardians of the Galaxy match with the world of the Black Panther. Um, if I can't take an obvious guess, it will be that I'm going to miss a lot of Easter eggs because I know there will be a lot of details in this. Like. It's just basically this, the accumulation of the two uh, worlds that are very rich of like cultures and histories that collides with one another. So without further ado, let's just get started. But in a multiverse of infinite possibility. Morak, okay, good. Same location as the Guardian. Destiny determined by your nature or by the nature of your world. Okay, I'm waiting for him to dance. Is he gonna dance to come and get your love? Oh, Star Lord! <laughs> <laughs> Lol, Cora, this fanboying, sort of like who? That was not the reaction I was expecting. Yeah, same. Hey, 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 stop! Show some respect! Stop it! That's my idol right there! Star Lord, legendary out Robin Hood. Steals from the powerful and gives to the powerless. Should we be bowing? This is just like Bruce Banner meeting him. Surely something this powerful is better off in my hands. It's just that my boss, Ronan, super, super. Are we gonna see Lee Pace as Ronan? I didn't see his name though, like at the beginning of the credit. Dance, but I could be convinced to make a career change. A oh. career change. You sure? Go ahead to use the guy. Oh, that is so generous of you. That is basically my reaction if I were talking to T'Challa, like... I barely moved, hit me! <laughs> Classic Stano. Classic Korath. Just like that, he's just gonna join his idol like that. Well, I mean, that's quite relatable. A Ravager never flies solo. Where's your backup, sir? Dad. Yes. Who's the Sleeping Beauty? A new recruit. He was after this as well. It's interesting that Yondu knows what a Sleeping Beauty is. The child probably tells him the story of Sleeping Beauty, right? Though our hero's destiny might lie in the stars above, the beginning of his journey was much more down to earth. There's an entire world out there, Baba. Yes, one of war. Oh, why is there like two seats? in that throne. But we must be brave enough to search for it. I do understand, my son. Mm, classic T'Challa's arc. What you call destiny is just an equation. As fate would have it, at that very moment, a Ravager spacecraft was arriving on Earth to abduct the spawn of the celestial ego. <laughs> okay, so the parallel is that between him and Quill before they were just like abducted by this Ravagers. The last person that they're in touch with um, is their parents, um, Peter Quill with his dying mother and him with his dad. But in this universe, Yondu outsourced the assignment to his subordinates. Mm. You morons grabbed the wrong kid. Two sea holes, two here holes, <laughs> one. Does really look like Peter Quill? <laughs> sure, I don't know. All humans look alike to me. At this point, like every kid from Earth just looks like a Peter Quill to this guy. The cosmic readings where he was took nearly broke our dial. Well, my home is built on an ancient vibranium meteorite. Oh, so it's because of the vibranium that they found him. What you doing out there all by yourself anyway? Exploding the world. And he's so cool the way that he's not afraid. Yondu's like, mm, this boy is, this boy will do. But why stop at one world, huh? When we can show you all of them. Mm, Yondu's knows qualities when he sees it. How exactly did you stop Thanos, the mad titan from decimating half of the universe? Whoa. <laughs> That's so scary. I'm a big enough man to admit when I'm wrong. Literally and figuratively. Dollar here showed me there was more than one way to reallocate the universe's resources. The best weapon in your arsenal is just a good argument. So he just like talked, to, he just argued with him and then like Thanos like, oh, you're right. Wow, the power that he has. Although I still assert my plan was not without its merits. Uh, cool motive, still murder. Pretty sure it's still just genocide. Exactly, yeah, sir. Sure. Your money is no good here. Draxy. Let us take a picture. 
to send to my wife and daughter. Oh, oh my god. So his wife and daughter are still alive. This is basically a utopian version of everything that happened. You look terrible. I look great. <laughs> no, Classic I Drax. He looks pretty good from where I'm standing. Say that to yourself, ma'am. Nebula. Hey, Cha-Cha. I'm gonna call him that. <laughs> I'm gonna call him that. The big guy know you have this? You mean your father? You know he gardens now. You should talk to him. Oh, in any other universe, in every reality, Thanos' passion is still gardening. When I was young, Yandu attempted to return me to Wakanda, but it had been destroyed. <gasps> no! Oh, no, is Shuri okay? Do I have a job for you? That beat sounds so familiar. Oh, Ant-Man! The Embers of Genesis. But with the power to terraform entire ecosystems. See? Thanos' problem solved. Don't tell Captain Genocide over here. <laughs> I thought you work alone, daughter. Wait, 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 wait. You mean she's your offspring? <laughs> well, he, the way he says it is just... The implication is just so weird. So who's the mark? Tanalir Tavon, also known as... The Collector? The collector. As in the most ruthless kingpin in the intergalactic underworld? Oh, okay, so we have kingpin, the bald guy here. You have kingpin, this kingpin, the Collector in space. He'll dissect you for a science project, frame whatever's left, and hang you up on the walls. Oh, he's basically gonna collect him. So long as the collector's involved, we are not. He's gonna defy his young dad. No, we steal from the rich and give to the poor. Just like that earthling folk hero of yours, right? Robin Leach. Robin. <laughs> Good. Whatever. <laughs> So he knows Sleeping Beauty, but he can't tell the difference between Robin Leach and Robin Hood. I love how Yondu's minds works. Amazing! I, I have no notes! A perfect plan! Oh. Okay, that's just basically the title of this video. The Collector. Oh, my dearest Nebula, aren't you a side for a sore eye? That's not how you talk to a lady. Cosmo! The collection is much bigger than I anticipated. Oh my god, is that like, what, Malachis? One of Malachis, Ma or is that Malachis? My guess, he's compensating for something big. How are you? Yeah, I'm looking for something. The Embers of Genesis. Kalui at the Frost Giants, a Hard Ralph at the Cronus. You're gonna see a sign for Elvish literature. That is so many things inside that sentence. So there's like, collection of Frost Giant? What do you mean by that? Is there like any lobbies? being dissect and then like Cronin. Cronin is basically Cork's peoples, right? And then like elvish literature. Oh my god, this is basically an elf baiting episode. It's like, I want to see more of the elves, particularly the light elves. Cause like, I want to see like, what are those literatures be? Would I be able to read it? Ooh, <laughs> wrong universe. <laughs> it feels so weird to see Proxima Midnight not working for Thanos. Dude, we have to go. Oh. Whoa, there's so many ships in here. That one is a Nova Corpse. I think that one is from Ragnarok, right? It's a, it's a Grandmasters. That looks like a, the, the Milano. But like the other ones, I don't know. Oh my god, there's so many Easter eggs in here. Is that the Dora Milaje? <gasps> no. T'Challa, Baba, if you are out there and we will search every last one of them, until we find you on this plane or the next. Oh, Cha Cha. I had a debt with the collector and you were the payment. Oh my god. So Nebula is evil? Told me my homeland had been destroyed. Sometimes you need to hear a lie to see the truth. No. Belong up here with us, with your family. You are not my family. Why is this so sad? Like, they already have this amazing found family dynamic, but this happened. Apologize for all that 
awkwardness back there with Nebula. I simply abhor drama. I hate drama while saying it in a dramatic way. Are you sure you cannot fly or shoot lasers out of your eyes or something? That's just Superman. <laughs> Where I come from, history has never looked kindly on those who lock men in cages. Oh, and oh. Let's not waste the wall space. Dissect them and strip his remains for parts. <sighs> Daughter of mine. You are the worst! Ooh. Hmm. Not like you to change your mind. Oh, I didn't. This was always the plan. I told it was T'Challa's idea to keep you in the dark. Look where we ended up. All a distraction for to obtain this. I wonder like if Ant-Man's gang is here, would they be able to pull this off? Foolish. Oh. <laughs> Thank you. I am forever in your debt. Karina is the hero of the day. What kind of being leaves a party without saying goodbye? Like every big Marvel bad guy has a gauntlet at this point. Observe. A dagger forged in dark matter. <gasps> oh, is that what Malekith used? Taken from the ruler of the dark elves. Yeah. <laughs> uh, stop it with the elf baiting, okay? <laughs> There's wait 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 a minute. How is that like a uh, Captain America's shield? Okay. Play with absurd. I believe there's Mjolnir. A dagger oh my god. This is so quick. There's Mjolnir and Matter. there's like even the shield the and Hela's helm. A necrosaur, courtesy of the Asgardian goddess of death. How did he get that from her even? Get to the ship. Are you crazy? Not crazy. Man. Oh. Wait, is that like a callback to like, I'm always angry? Ah. And now your new family has abandoned you. Ravager never flies solo. No way in hell I was gonna leave here without my kid. Yon dad is still yon dad. Never have I thought that I would have a sympathy for Thanos being tortured. I thought when he eats the thing, he's gonna turn into a Groot or something. Come on! Yes. Let's go! What about Yandu and T'Challa? I'm sure they're doing fine. <laughs> Spoiler, they are not doing fine. Okay, any ideas? Oh my god, I'm so scared that Yondu's gonna die for the second time in here. Sticky fingers. What are you doing? That all you got? They're doing their own get help. Wow, that's, really just, get... that's a really cool montage. I trust you'll know what to do with this. No touching, Karina. No. Karina's like, Karina, yes! Stop and oh. take I took care of all of you. I put a roof over your head. <laughs> Doesn't mean that you nurture them, babe. Looks like we... Yay, Cosmo is free! I just wanted to say, uh... There's no need. All you did was show me the universe. Mm. Oh, yeah. There ain't no place in this galaxy where you don't belong. Of course, he's wanted anywhere and everywhere. Where you want to be, you're just gonna have to follow your heart on that one. Oh, he's going home. He's going to Wakanda. Baba, we introduce you to the family I made along the way. Uh Oh, love this found family trip. That sounds an awful lot like it. Whoa, Okoye talking to Thanos, petting Cosmo. This is the kind of AU fanfiction that I live for. Except in here, it's not a fanfiction. This is this is canon. I like, I am best friend. Oh yeah, my yeah, god, Korra and Shuri! How exactly my son came to be in your spaceship. Uh-oh. <laughs> and from one family reunion to another. That's great. Is that, is that, is that Peter Quee? Uh, sorry, we're close. My Peter, can't spare a little time for dear old dad. Too bad this might spell the end of the world, but that's a story for another day. Whoa, tell me that story. I need that episode now. Oh my God. 
dedicated to our friend, our inspiration, and our hero. Alright, so that was it. Our watch along slash, it's more like a commentary reaction of the episode 2 of what if series there are so many easter eggs like even like the the objects for example that was that moment with the collector where he shows his collection of weapons there's probably a lot, a lot of things that i missed from the dialogue as well because they kind of like they talk quite quick you couldn't really go wrong right like with the chala being the star lord Plus, that heist element is just so exciting. Like, hands down, like, the best episode of What If so far. How are you gonna top this episode, though? Like, so I don't know. At this at this moment, when I'm doing this video, I don't know. I, I'm not following the news what kind of episode that will come out next week. That episode really needs a lot of good luck because this episode is really good how are you gonna top this episode okay so uh yeah all in all that was my reaction but before i sign out i would like to thank everyone who made it through the end i uh, thank you guys so much for watching i'll see you soon and may your tea will always be warm for watching